everyone and welcome. This is Melissa Armo with the Stock Swoosh and today I'm reviewing the play of the day, which is PKS. It's actually still going. I'm not in this anymore. It wouldn't make sense to be in this anymore unless you just were holding a piece of this down, but it does appear that it's going to the dream target, 1375, 1365, 1350. Am I surprised? No. Why? It was a good gap. What I am surprised about is the fact that I even did it today though. And I'll tell you why. The market volume is so low this week. It is extremely low. It's almost surprisingly low. I know that Labor Day was Monday, but today is actually Wednesday, and I would have thought that things would have picked up by now, but I guess it's really gonna be until next week. And then it'll be the fall, and there'll be lots and lots and lots of things to do. But this week was a week to be very, very careful, which I was today, but I really wanted to do this. And the amazing thing about this today is that I rated this gap with one tick, one tick, and I knew it would work. So I gotta give myself a round of applause actually for doing this today, because normally I have very strict volume requirements. It wasn't there in this today. I knew it was gonna work anyways, and I actually did it, okay? But it was thin. It was thin as beans. And the most significant thing that was thin about it was the gap. So I'm just going to show you here. I didn't see any of this. Nothing, 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 nothing. I saw this. One tick. <laughs> I actually can't even believe I did this today. I just, you know, I just knew I knew it would work. And I rated it. And I rated it, but it did not... It, it, it really just had no volume. It just had no volume. So it might not have worked because of the lack of volume, but, but it did. It did and I did it and it worked and the whole room made money. So let's go over it. This, this was a nice call. And I waited here because again, the volume is a situation and you cannot take a trade and put in a stop and expect it to hold or go without volume. You gotta have volume, which you have now, but you have to have movement and volume shares people in it to move the stock otherwise it's not going to go anywhere and not only that you have to have it to get the gap to stick on the gap and the amazing thing about this is that I saw that the gap would stick with one tick that is experience experience and knowing knowing what a good gap is and knowing what's really going to open and break this I was very patient I said there's nothing fast to do today don't go after anything crazy and we didn't we didn't do this here we didn't do it here we didn't do it here we didn't do it here I saw it here so I shorted this in here and it broke. And to be honest with you, even at this point that I entered the trade with the size that I had, I was like, this is thin. So it dropped. Right thing to do was to get out of half in here or something because of the thinness. Even at this point, it was thin. Then it rallied up, held beautifully, and it dropped and broke and went to the target. So a very, very, very nice short today in BKS. It is still going. Time of the day is almost 11 o'clock. I really feel like you could almost bar by bar this if we're still in there, everyone should be out of it. It went to the target, which is 14, but it looks like it's on its way to the dream target, which is really 1375 or 1365 or 1350. I don't think this goes to 13 today, could it? Sure, anything's possible, it's just selling off. If you didn't take the short that I called in this today, you actually had no entry. And if you had taken the short where I called it today, you really had to know and understand gaps to do it because the volume was so low and it just was low. It is still a few days after the holiday, but this was a beautiful gap and I have to pat myself on the back for doing it and knowing it would work with one tick in the morning to rate the gap, because that is really not enough people to see that it would do it and let alone take a trade, okay? But this was the best gap today and it worked. So nice way in here to end a Wednesday of a trading day. No matter what you did with this today, it was a nice move. Huge R's if he held it all the way down to 14 from where I entered it and actually put the stop. And I think the right thing to do though was to piece out of it if you had any significant volume in it. But no matter what happened in this today, everyone made money in the room. It was a nice call and it was a beautiful trade. If anyone would like more information on the Golden Gap course, you can email me at melissa at thestockswish.com. The next class is September 19th and 20th. That will be the last class before the price of the class goes up. So if you want to do the class, email me for registration papers to learn how to find gaps like this, how to take the trades. Once you sign up for the class, you are eligible to register and sign up for the live trading room. 
We had a whole discussion today about how to train your brain with with trading because uh, I mean this is the perfect example here the fact I I have trained myself so well that I would know that this gap would work with one tick and 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 this is you know seven and a half years of trading nothing but gaps my 26 point rating system you know even the entry I called in this today was incredible because it really was not it was no volume it was a late entry look this is going to go to seven where's my seven dollar limit I knew this was the best gap today. Look at this. Wow. I I need to say something here. This, if, if, I don't think anyone from the room is in this, but this was so many R's from the original entry, it's almost staggering. What a nice call this was here today. I knew this was the best gap. Anyways, if you're interested in learning how to pick the best thing to trade every day that's going to have volume and work and go and have the risk to reward and the movement and the momentum like I do, email me at melissa at thestockswoosh.com. Have a great day, everyone. Play of the day was BKS. Nailed it again. Have a good weekend.